what up everybody welcome back to Islamabad Pakistan I hope you're feeling good feeling great nightfall is upon us uh, in just a little bit I'm going to take you uh, to my new hotel it's a beauty it's about $50 a night and uh, I'm gonna show you uh, my hotel room which is mega mega nice but more importantly we're gonna go chow down on some amazing room service food the menu uh, at, at the restaurant that's located in the hotel it's absurd they got like Turkish food uh, Arabic food Pakistani food of course but before we eat all that we gotta burn some calories gotta get some exercise in you dig what I'm saying we're here at F9 Fatima Jinnah Park I can't believe it took me almost a month to get to this park I walked on the perimeter uh, but now we're walking deep into the heart for just maybe an hour or so getting these 10,000 steps really really like what I'm seeing so far this place is packed people everywhere oh there's the leisure arena over there so if you need some leisure that's where you're gonna go I guess look at this uh, almost like Taj Mahal type looking structure uh, in front no offense I realize this is in India I hope it's not offensive to say like it looks like the Taj Mahal but it's kind of got that dome uh, aesthetic to it out there Wow, and apparently oh this. Uh, ah, Assalamu alaikum. How are you, brothers? Good, good. Abkanam kia, hey? Hassan. Hassan, Shairuz. nice to meet you. Shahruz? Yeah. Nice to meet you. What's your name, man? Ali. Ali. Oh, I like your, I like your ring. Really, really cool, man. Oh no, no, we no, 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 no smokes for me. Only the breath of uh, God in my lungs. Shukriya. Take care, my friends. Ciao, ciao. Smoking some heaters. Ah, Assalamu alaikum. Hello, brothers. They really like the tobacco out here in Pakistan. I've noticed. I haven't seen much shisha. But man, they love smoking those lung darts. None of that for me. Okay, we're getting a little sunset action here. Wish I would have come just maybe five to ten minutes earlier. But uh, the, the Uber driver took a sweet time. The in-driver driver took a sweet time. The Uber driver stunk up the joint. Uh, I've already complained enough about Uber drivers here. We don't need to do that anymore. Look at this view of the Margola Hills in the background. It rained last night. It was, it was a crazy, crazy storm. I thought the world was going to end. Um, so that means clear skies today, which is good. And it's kind of cool with all like uh, the moisture in the ground and, and then the cool air that came through last night. This is like the coolest I've been in Islamabad. It's almost like, ah, shukriya my friends. Assalamu alaikum. It's almost sweater weather out here, y'all. As usual, the Pakistani people are friendly. They're happy. They're nice. They're feeling good. They're feeling great. Wow. This is cool. Okay, I've seen so many fountains in Pakistan and not a single one has been on or activated. I know it's not like a drought condition out here because they just had a ton of rain last night and like with the floods and everything, but maybe they're just trying to conserve. But no idea why the fountains don't, uh, don't, don't gush, whatever you want to say. Wow, look at this. This, th this is a giant park. Correct me if I'm wrong, feel free in the comments. I think this is the second largest park uh, in Islamabad. The biggest one being like the national park. Oh, this is a cool, cool vibe right here, everybody. So many people just out and about looking for anyone throwing the old pigskin. No one throwing an NFL football around. I'd, I'd chuck it for a little bit if I, if I saw it. We're certainly not gonna explore the whole place because we're hungry and it's gonna get dark soon and dark, uh, dark no light and GoPro it's not not a good combination so we're gonna poke around maybe we're gonna meet a few more people assalamu alaikum hello hello and uh, see what we see but this right here this is this is chill this is uh, this is the most naturey uh, place I found in Islamabad for sure yeah, assalamu alaikum how are you brother Good. Abkanam kia hai. Nice to meet you, my friend. Yes, you will come in which city? Uh, I'm from uh, United States. United States. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Take care, my friend. Ciao, ciao. Always meeting nice and friendly people out here. Man, yeah, I, this is definitely the kind of park you can spend like days at. Just looking at like the square footage on the map, it goes for like miles and miles and miles. We got some guys over here. Assalamu alaikum. Filming a TikTok, they're doing their thing. Assalamu alaikum. Hello, hello. Ah, uh, kya hai? Abdul Salim. Abdul Salim, nice yes. name, man. Nice to meet you. you. Good, good. What's your name? Abdul Manaf. I got a question, guys. Yes, sir. What is your favorite Pakistani food? Food. Uh. Favorite Pakistani food? Mango. Mango. Yeah, very nice. But out I of season it. right now, right? Yes, man. It's no longer in season. Ah, shukriya, shukriya. And what's your favorite food? Say again? Lahore. He said, uh, he see you in Lahore. Oh, you saw me in Lahore. Yes. 
like on video or you saw yes. me in the streets? Yes. Oh, very cool. Oh, Bashai Majid? Bashai yes, yes, I filmed some videos there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see it? Bashai in Bashai Majid backside. Oh, very yeah. cool. Hello, some friends are calling us over. Assalamu alaikum. What's your name? You cannot understand. I'm a. But my name is Shah Ista. The Shah. Shah Ista. Shah Ista. Yeah, Ista. Beautiful Uzma. name. Yes. And your name? Uzma. Uzma. So nice to meet you. Same here. I love Same Pakistan. Here. The people are so oh, nice and so, so friendly. Where you belong? Uh, you? I I belong uh, from the United States in uh, oh, a city United called Minnesota. So. Okay. Yeah. How long have you been here? Forty-two days now. So yeah, it's been amazing. Well, I've only been to Lahore, Murray, and Islamabad because I've had a lot of work here. But mm -hmm. I'm going to Karachi, uh, Peshawar, um, Abbottabad oh. soon. And then um, I really wanted to go to like Gilgit and the Hunza Valley. But because of the floods, I, I couldn't go. I'm so, going to Karachi. Karachi? Yes. Yeah, next week. You're from Karachi. I'm, yes, we I'm are. I'm also visiting here. Ah, oh, you're a tourist as well. Amazing. <laughs> I have to go to further on, like uh, Kash Kashmir. To Kashmir. I really want to go to Kashmir. I hope I have time to go while I'm here. Kashmir I'm here in. Is very, very big. Yeah, I've heard. The per Pearl of Pakistan. Pearl, the Pearl of Pearl Pakistan. Pakistan. Ooh, I haven't heard that. I love that. Because you... I also uh, used to uh, see your videos, like. Oh, you've seen my videos. Yeah. Oh, you know who I am. Oh, thank you so much. That means so, a lot to me. Uh, I know who are the famous people uh, making the radio. That's so. very sweet. Thank you. Thank you. Can I ask you, what are your favorite Pakistani foods? What's your number one favorite Pakistani food? Because I've heard Karachi is the best food. Yes. Some of the best food in Pakistan. Karachi is very spicy, like foods, uh, biryani. 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 I hear yes. I have to try the white biryani. I hear that's really good. And, and, and what, uh, like yellow and... Biryani? Oh, biryani, maybe we already know. Well, yeah. oh, I've had it many times, ah, but yes. I hear it's better in Karachi. I and hear the Karachi uh, biryani. All types of kebabs are very, very famous there and very good in taste. Oh, I love kebabs. The kebab. biryani of Karachi is very, very good. Mm, yes. You cannot find in Islam. Like ah. So, but in Karachi, the food is very good, very ah. spicy, very authentic, yeah. real Pakistani yeah. food. Oh. Yeah. Well, it was so nice meeting you. Okay. Yes. Okay. See you again, inshallah. You. Bye, bye bye. Here we are. The Grand Islamabadi Hotel with the Havana Terrace restaurant. I guess that's where we're gonna get the room service food from. Assalamu alaikum, how are you, brother? Yeah. Oh, cool gun. All right, let's open the doors here. Oh, very, very nice. Entryway here. Assalamu alaikum. Oh, they got some takeout ready to go there. They got, they got the right idea right there. Oh, a little rooftop action. A little too dark for that, and uh, we're craving room service. So, Assalamu alaikum, how are you, brother? How are you? Grand Islamabad Hotel. Aap ka naam kya hai? Nice to meet you, my friend. What's the best thing on the menu? What's the best thing that I should eat tonight for room service? What's the best food? Uh, best food is uh, beef mundi. Beef? Mundi. Beef mundi? Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. Okay, the man says beef mundi. We're going to get the beef mundi. I love that. It takes the pressure off me having to figure out what I want to eat. Beef mundi it is. Oh, all right. Looks like we got a little cafe action in here, too. Assalamu alaikum. Cool, very modern. Oh, check it out. It's got like these newspaper style chairs. Some ketchup on the table. What is this nonsense? Garfield? Get out of here, no way. What? That's uh, Gordon Ramsay, I believe. And that's a picture of lasagna. Assalamu alaikum, how are you? And that's Garfield. Good, good, how are you? That's chef, I don't know the name. Gordon Ramsay. Oh, Gordon Ramsay. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. But do you know who that is? Garfield. Garfield. Yeah, yeah. Do the Pakistanis love Garfield? Uh, I'm not sure, but we do. We, you love Garfield. Okay. I love Garfield too. Oh, we got some nice desserts over here. Assalamu alaikum, brother. Wow, we got what looks to be a red velvet cake. We yes, got some. Red, yes. What's the best one? I think the chocolate fudge is nice. The chocolate fudge. Okay. Yeah, nice. All around the world, the universal favorite is always chocolate. People love chocolate, chocolate. Aap ka naam kya hai? Umar. Umar, nice to meet you, my friend. Thank you, sir. Thank are, you, are you working here at the hotel? I am the operational manager. Yes. Oh, it's a beautiful hotel, man. Thank you. I love it, I love it, I love it. My friend at the front desk, he said the best food on the menu is the beef mundi. 
Ah, beef bandi, yes. Is that good? That's good, beef bandi rice, yes. What, what else do you recommend? Is there, is there uh, one that's better than the beef bandi? What do you want? Do you want Pakistani so, or fast I love, food? I love Pakistani, no fast food. Then mandi will do. Beef mandi, okay, okay, very well. I'm gonna get that in a little while here. I'm gonna go up and explore the room. Assalamu alaikum, all. We're doing coffees and cappuccinos and chai tea, right? Yes. Because ev everybody loves chai. Okay, very cool. All right, well, I'll be uh, down shortly. Nice Thank to meet you, you my God friend. Yeah, Shukriya, take care. Very nice, very nice atmosphere, very nice presentation. Um, oh, look at that, it's, it's, it's the mirror. In case you're wondering where the mirror is, it's right here. Wow, that makes life a lot easier. I assume they put that there because a lot of people are walking into the mirror. Uh, oh, I was about to board uh, the elevator, but only four persons allowed. Assalamu alaikum. And uh, it was a family there, so I don't like to turn the camera on families. I know it's like a privacy thing. Assalamu alaikum. How are you guys? How are you? Good, good, good. How can I'm Kia, hey? Muhammad Usman, Ah, nice to meet you, my friend. Your name? Muhammad <laughs> Nice to meet you guys. Your name? Malik Aman. Are you staying here at the hotel? You're staying at the hotel, eh? I am visiting for only some My Malaysian time. bikers coming to, uh, tonight. Bikers? Yeah. To ride bikes, eh? Yes. Wow. For Very cool. For exploration of Pakistan, northern area. Oh, you're going to go to Hanza and like Ferry yeah. Meadows? Yeah, yeah. Very cool. <laughs> oh, and, and here's, 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 I, I met you before. Nice to see yeah, you, my yeah. friend. How are you? Tell everybody, Hi. tell everybody your name. Atif Rizwan. Nice to meet I you, man. I'm a sailor over here. So, how is your stay here? Oh, it's amazing. It's amazing. I'm excited. Good my good name is Brent Tim. From? United States. Oh, welcome oh, to Pakistan. He's like, he's like a very famous YouTuber. Oh, so, nah, uh, famous. Can... That's all relative, yeah, yeah. really. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But yeah. Uh, yeah, very excited to show everybody the room and, uh, and yeah, the hotel here. So thank you, my friend. Thank you. So we'll see you soon. Ciao, ciao. Nice meeting you guys. Oh, Have a safe ride. Inshallah. Oosh. I got the power. All right. And welcome to my abode. Welcome to my hotel room. Boom. Power on. Big fan of that. Growing up, this thing never existed. This is where if you want power, you gotta essentially keep your key card in so you can't leave the room and let the power just run. <sighs> this place. This is way too nice for me. 100%, I'm used to staying in hostels. I'm used to staying in bunk bed situations. This is, this is far, far too nice. Got some nice like vinyl artwork on the wall. Looks like it was stitched or something. Just take a nice big pan here. TV on the wall. Digging the colors. The greens mixed with the oranges, a very kind of like 70s vibe a little bit. Uh, some, some wall paintings, hangs. We'll go uh, start things off in the bathroom. Uh, also, everywhere in Pakistan, you get the, the slippers that you're supposed to wear in the bathroom. Uh, let's see what we got for the toilet trees. Got a shaving kit, a dental kit, a comb, and uh, oh yeah, this, this, this was the soap. All your typical stuff, the shampoos, I'm guessing this is a good bath gel. Mm. Use that later. And a body lotion. Okay, okay, okay. Nice, uh, nice like decorative tile here. The fan humming. The good old toilet. No need to, no need to go too deep in there. And then some nice tiling on the shower as well. This has been one of the few places I've been in Pakistan where I've had hot water. I spend two or three hours in a, in a hot shower since I've been here. So, so nice. Oh, wow, look at that. They even, they like gave me a, you know the towel is, is clean because they got it in like a plastic trash bag or something. Cool. All right. Nice little desk where we eat at. That is where the room service spread will arrive. And then we got our big bed. Man, what is that, a king size? I'm spoiled. I don't, I don't deserve this at all. This is, this is killer. 50 bucks a night. Mega, mega deal. I like this uh, lighting above here too. It got like the lighting kind of like raised and then in, in the cracks there as well. There's our phone. That's where we're going to be calling the room service. There's the room service menu. We're going to dabble in that in a second. Oh, it's dark out, so I can't even show you the view. Stay tuned until the end of the video where I'll wake up tomorrow and show you the view. It's, it's, a, it's a pretty nice view. We got a good old fridge. Did they give me anything? Ah, some waters. Some of the fridges, uh, some hotels hook you up with like candy bars and stuff, cold drinks. We don't need, we don't need any of that. Um, the most important thing at any place I stay these days now as a digital nomad is the desk. Comfortable place to work, essential. People like going to coffee shops. I like coffee shops, they cost money. I'd much rather wake up and start working right here. 
Um, we got the closet space. Boom. Good old Quran. Some some of my old clothes that I threw up there. Oh, uh, and what is what do we got here? Oh, and all my other clothes. Okay, but yeah, a ton of closet space. Come on now, who in God's name is using this? This is that's so unessential, so unnecessary for a hotel. What? Throw out my shoulder if I put anything up there. Ah, assalamu alaikum. Hello, hello, come in. Wow, what a spread. That looks amazing. Oh my God, wow. Unreal. So this must be the beef handi. Wow, it's got like that bread on top there. There's the, there's the, oh. Baba ganoush. Baba ganoush. Yes. Oh, the cheese naan, the chai. Let me get you a tip, my friend, one moment. Thank you, thank you so much. Ah, this looks unreal. Okay, what have I done? What have I done? I've ordered so much food here. Okay, they gave us uh, what looks to be some uh, just typical naan, I believe, ketchup, and, and four plates. You might think there are four people here with all this food, but no, no, no. Just one very hungry hippo boy. Okay, we got the cheese naan. We got the kheer, I believe that's the pudding. And then we've got the baba ganoush. Some eggplant with some olives and a ton of olive oil. And this is the beef mandi. Cannot wait to open that up and see what we got inside. And then we got some chai. Well, half a glass of chai. So I'm tired and in desperate need of some energy, so we're gonna sip on the chai. This was some kind of special chai, too. Pow. Oh my god, that's foul. What is that? That's not chai. That's like butter. What? This is like someone took chai tea and, and mixed it with butter. What did I order? It was a special kind of chai. It was the elachi chai. That is, that is, no. No, not for me. No, uh, I'm sure like the rest of the food is good, but like, uh, wow, that elachi chai, that was the worst thing I drank. Not as, is it as bad as the lemon soda? It's butter. It's like ghee or butter with the tea. Doesn't even, doesn't even make any sense. Let's go backwards here. I wanna try some of the kheer to start things off. Kheer is like kind of a rice pudding. Take a look at that. Ooh, nice thick creamy. We're doing dessert first because there's no rules when you order room service, baby. Pow. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Very sweet, very simple. The rice cooked to perfection in there. It looks like we've got a little bit of like, what is that? Maybe some nuts? Mmm. Mm. I can't tell, maybe some dates. It's very good though. It's very smooth, very basic. Some of the best foods in the world, some of the best flavors are just simple, simple foods and flavors. That's what we got right there. All right, I'm, I'm more interested in the cheese naan, but since we got baba ganoush, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna dip this in. We're just gonna go straight in, baby. We're gonna get a lot of that oil. Oh, look at that. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Dip it right in. Pow. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. That's fresh. That's really, really fresh. The eggplant, super nice. Mmm. Very like citrusy. Oh, where's that citrus coming from in there? Maybe it's coming from the coriander? No, there's something else in there. Maybe like the chopped red peppers and, and green peppers are giving it a nice like fresh, fresh veggie taste. That's bomb. That's really, really bomb. What else we got here? We got, I think this is like a chutney. Dip that in there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's good. Minty. Mm-hmm. Very, very good. Okay. I think, I mean, I need the caffeine boost. I think I got to call and like order a traditional green tea or something because that was, that, that alachi chai, hachi machi alachi, that was not good at all. And spoiler alert, um, I literally took like a two hour nap in between the time I finished this video and then when I eventually ended up ordering. I was just so, so tired, so, so wiped. Okay, the cheese naan. This, the cheese naan is on top. And it's, I guess it's also in the middle. It's like leaked down to the top. Usually the cheese naan is kind of stuff. It smells good. Pow! Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Solid cheese naan. I'm gonna go ahead and dip it deep in that chutney so I can get some of that flavor on there. Mmm. A very mild milk cheese. I would like it if the naan was cooked a little more crispier, just, just was in the oven for maybe like one to two more minutes. But it's good. I'm definitely gonna crush it, and you better believe I'm gonna mix 
that she's non with um, with the baba ganoush. Sorry, I'm losing my mind. I, I fell asleep because uh, for my rib injury, they gave me these like anti-inflammatory pills. I'm, oh, it was out like a light, like a light, like a light. Okay, this looks similar to like a biryani that we had um, at Manal restaurant. And they told me that you can't eat this on top. There's no way, you have to be able to eat this. It's just absurd to not be able to eat it. So let's let's pull this back here and, and see what we can review. Oh, you see that steam emanating from there? Wow, what? Hold on, I got the half order too. Did I tell them the half order? Did they give me the full order? Oh, wow, that's gotta be it. That's, that's the biggest order on, on planet Earth. Ooh, what are we working with there? It looks like some raisins. Oh, I bet this is gonna be like sweet. Yeah, definitely, definitely gonna be sweet. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and, and, and stop messing around and just pull all this off right here. This has to be edible, right? Why would they put this bread on top if you couldn't eat it? That's like half the fun, right? Yeah, this is like a thin like roti wrapped all around it. I don't, I don't care what they're saying. Mm. Roti? Hot, steamy, nice. And then we got, oh, okay. Wow, oh, jeez. Yeah. Oh, I can already tell it's so tender. It's fallen off the bone. Oh, we're going straight in, straight in. We're grabbing some of that beef. Oh, it almost looks like, like shredded, like roast beef almost. And some of that rice and there's carrots in there. Okay, first bite of the chicken. No, sorry, of the beef mandi. Beef mandi, beef mandi. I'm losing my mind, pow. Mmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Very roast beefy, uh, shredded, um, succulent, juicy, a mild flavor uh, with the with the rice, which is kind of like a palau rice. It's uh, not no spiciness to it at all. Um, is there a sweetness in here? Mmm. The tiniest little bit of, of, of sweetness. This is definitely one of those dishes, like the biryani, where you want to enjoy all the flavors in the rice. You don't want to add like hot sauce or anything to this. It's uh, it's just simple and good how it is. Some more of that beef. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's nice. That's good, Mondi. That's good, good, Mondi, baby. Wow. Okay, I got some eating to do. I got some more tea to order as well. Um, thanks for sharing a meal with me. I will see you in the morning when we can peep that view and uh, we'll say goodbye to each other. But yeah, let's take one more look at it. Beef Mondi, definitely get it again. Baba Ganoush, definitely get it again. Never speaking of it, I don't even want to say the name. Of that the uh, cheese naan yeah 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 and of course the kir feast time I looked it up alachi chai is cardamom tea no 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 cardamom flavor in there what is what is going on that is butter there was a mistake in the kitchen I don't know all right as promised morning time has arrived let's take a look at this view let's see oh we can't walk out this way we're gonna walk out this way, I think we can walk out. I haven't even checked yet. Rained again a little bit last night. Okay, we're stepping out. Oh, it's a mirror right there, unexpected. So here's what we're seeing from this side. Not a lot going on, but bam, bam, bam. There it is, the Margola Hills, baby. Looking beautiful, looking nice. And that's that. My name is Brent Tim from the Grand Islamabad Hotel. Really hope you enjoyed the food. Really hope you enjoyed the tour. No pool, no gym here, nothing like that, but hey, we just need a comfy bed and good food, you dig? I'm saying ciao for now.